السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس دس از ڈاکٹر محمد اشرف ان دس ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس ہاؤ ٹو کنڈکٹ ملٹی کولینیرٹی ٹیسٹ ان ایس پی ایس ایس ملٹی کولینیرٹی بیسیکلی ریفرس ٹو دا ریلیشن شپ بٹوین ایکسپلینیٹری ویریبلس اینڈ اٹ اکرس وین دیر آر اسٹرانگ ڈیپینڈینسیز امنگ دا ایکسپلینیٹری ویریبلس دا پریزنس آف ملٹی کولینیرٹی انفلوئنسز دا ریزلٹس آف دا ریگولیشن ماڈل بائی ریڈیوسنگ دا ابیلٹی ٹو پرڈک ڈیپینڈنٹ ویریبل as well as to determine the distinct effect of explanatory variables. Therefore, the deduction of this problem is necessary. Multicularity is identified by checking the three methods. Number one, tolerance value. Number two, variance of inflation factor values. And number three, Egan values for each regression variable. Tolerance refers to the percentage of variance in the predictor that cannot be accounted for by other predictors. The small tolerance value indicates that the predictor is redundant. If the tolerance value is less than 0.1 and variance of inflation factor value is greater than 10, then it indicates that predictors are highly correlated and may require further investigation. In order to examine multicularity in SPSS, we need to go in analyze. Under the analyze, there is an option regression and as you hover the regression, there will be an other option linear. We have to click this option and then we can see this dialog box. Under this dialog box, we have to insert dependent variable and independent variables. First, we have to select dependent variable. Organizational Environment Performance OEP this is basically a dependent variable i will insert here and remaining all other variables are independent variable okay i have inserted dependent and independent variables now we have to use this option statistics now you can see here there is an option collinearity diagnostics i have to check this option and then click continue There is another option method here as you click in the drop down there are five different methods we have to keep this enter option as a method and then we have to click this okay button okay you can see in the regression there is different tables but we have to focus only tolerance and variance of inflation factor values as you can see this is a coefficient table in this table we can see these two columns tolerance and variance of inflation factor basically calculates the collinearity statistics here we can see that tolerance values for all explanatory variables are greater than 0.1 and vif which is variance of inflation factor values for all explanatory variables are less than 10 so we can infer that the multi collinearity issue with this data is not present there and we can infer that we can use this data for further analysis and moreover we can also determine dependent variable and we can also trace out the distinct effect of each explanatory variables if we see the next table we can find out egan values here the egan values should not be very close to the zero as we can see that some of the values are closer to the zero and some of the values are not very close to the zero if all the values or majority of the values are very closer to the zero then we have to examine next column which is the condition index column and according to statistics rules the values greater than 15 indicates the multi collinearity problems but if the values are greater than 30 then it shows a very strong indication for the multi collinearity problems but here we can see that most of the values are less than 30 it gives somehow you know understanding of the multi collinearity issue in the data but we normally report tolerance and variance of inflation factor values in our data analysis chapters and based on these two tolerance and variance of inflation factor values for each explanatory variables we can say that the data don't have a multi collinearity problem i hope in this video you have learned how to calculate multi collinearity statistics in SPSS if you have any question you can ask me in comment section i will try to answer your question as soon as possible if you have learned something from this video like it share it if you are new to this channel please subscribe it take care allah hafiz